Hey foodies, welcome back to Yummy Cafe with Ash. Today I'm going to show you a very unique recipe again. These are the beetroots which I boil, which I'm going to boil for salad, but the leaves are remain and they are so fresh and nice. So we are going to make a curry with this, and we are going to use some lentil with this as well. So let's chop this first, and I'll show you the other ingredients as well. So I chopped these leaves or stems and now I'm going to wash them thoroughly in a big bucket of water so that all the dirt will go away. So friends now as you can see this uh, leaves of uh, beetroot are clean and chopped and nicely washed. Now I'm going to start making curry with the moong dal. Moong dal is basically yellow lentil half cup we will take and we will soak it in the water after washing it nicely two three times and we'll take uh, little bit of uh, garlic little ginger about uh, one tablespoon both and two green chilies chopped one onion chopped and here you have option either you can add two tomatoes chopped or you can add half a lemon in the end and apart from that we need dry spices as usual uh, turmeric red chili powder salt coriander and we need zira as well and we'll take first of all in a pressure cooker two tablespoons of oil and make it hot now we'll add one teaspoon of zira into this let the zira crackle or cumin seeds it has to be golden brown now we'll add in this one tablespoon of garlic chopped If you want to skip the tomatoes in it, you can add when the whole recipe is done. In the end, you can add half lemon juice, about two tablespoons, or you can add two tomatoes. It's up to you. Now, after my garlic is getting golden brown, I'll add into this ginger and green chili, and followed by the onion. Let it be little golden brown. Just cook it little bit till the onion gets translucent. Now we will add into this the chopped beetroot leaves. Just like beetroot leaves are also very beneficial to your health, so don't throw them. Just cook them like. We have to cook it. This is about 300 grams of leaves. For this, we will add half cup of dal into this. You can take any dal, but here I am using moon dal. You can add chana dal or masoor dal, any one will be fine. Always taste nice with this. Now just give it a good mix. Now we will add our soap and wash yellow dal or moon dal into this. Mix it really well. And now I'm going to add the dry spices, half teaspoon of turmeric powder, one teaspoon of red chili powder, one and a half teaspoon of salt, and one teaspoon, one big heap of coriander powder, that means two tablespoons. You can add and mix it nicely. If you don't have pressure cooker, you can put it in the normal pan and it will take little more time but the procedure will be same now I'm going to add two tomatoes small tomatoes chopped into this and in this we are going to add half cup of water and 
will cover it and cook it up to 2-3 whistles. After 2 whistles you can put it on the slow flame and cook it another 5 minutes. This is almost done. Now we will serve it in a bowl. Look at this. The beetroot leaves have both red and green colors in this curry with the yellow lentil inside. Looks very very colorful, beautiful and healthy. Try this recipe and serve it with hot hot rice and please do let me know by your comments that how was it. Till the next time, enjoy this yummy beetroot curry with the rice. Till the next time, take care.